So we have nine runners going to the post, but it is the Philly one so wonderful who dominates the market at nine to four with insatiable second best at nine to two, 11 to two about Faris and Germano, Kingfisher Mill eight to one, Handsome Ridge 12s along with Garuda, Ivan Louis is 16s along with Riadian. All nine quoted then for the Brigadier Gerard Stakes. Well, one so wonderful then a warmish favourite, a big home. Willie, who of course had such a fantastic year winning the Derby on Benny the Dip last season. And this is his first um, time that he's ridden Kingfisher Mill in public, has ridden work on this horse, but never ridden Kingfisher Mill on a race course before. Uh, seven lengths forth to Romanov on his reappearance at Newmarket, but uh, had quite a season last season, winning the King over the seventh stakes and the Cumberland Lodge as well at Ascot over a mile and a half. Uh, is that the fact that they were a mile and a half the key then, David, that this might be a, a bit sharp? I don't think necessarily be a bit sharp. Um, is the other one. Just about all in, here's Mark Johnson. In. Garuda was very slow to stride in the Group 3 Brigadier Gerard stakes. There's plenty of early pace on her here with Farris on the inside and Kingfisher, Mill and Riadian who's racing back in third. These are then being followed by Insatiable and Germano is keen to get to the front, followed then by Handsome Ridge. There's then a break of a length and a half to Ivan Louis who's on the inside of One So Wonderful and Garuda after a tardy start. Going down towards the final seven furlongs and a good pace being set by Kingfisher Mill who's out in front to Farris on the inside, Germano in a very close third and he's making ground towards the outside to take second as they go towards the final six and a half furlongs. Insatiable is back in four, Riadin is racing in five, Handsome Ridge in six, followed then by one so wonderful Garuda around the outside and Ivan Louis out the back. Begin to make the turn now with Kingfisher Mill and Germano battling for the lead. Riadin is back in third. In fourth place is Farris towards the inside. Insatiable is turning wide in five. Handsome Ridge is next, followed then by one so wonderful who's in company with Garuda out wide and Ivan Louis still wags the tail. Making the turn past halfway in the Brigadier Gerard and they've gone a lightning pace so far in this rain softened ground. Kingfisher Mill by half a length to Germano in second. Turning in in third in the dark green is Riadian followed in the field then in four by Farris. Then comes Insatiable. Handsome Ridge Garuda one so wonderful with racing to do and Ivan Louis is last. Down the straight towards the final two and a half furlongs grabbing the rail. It's Germano who goes on to Riadian then comes Insatiable between horses Kingfisher Mill is dropping away with Handsome Ridge out wide. Garuda and then comes Farris, one so wonderful will not be winning, she's now last passed by Ivan Louis, down towards the final full and a half, and it's Insatiable and Mick Kinnan who strike the front, in second place is Germano Garuda is staying on in third then comes Riadian and Anson Ridge, but they're inside the final 150 yards, it's all Insatiable the one chasing home is Garuda but can't catch Insatiable, up towards the line, Insatiable takes the Brigadier Gerard for Mick Kinnan, in second Garuda Germano third, Riadian four and there's Insatiable. Insatiable can't get enough of Sandown. Always performs well here. Very lightly raced. Uh, won a mile handicap here a uh, couple of seasons ago. Was off for a full year before winning at Newmarket over 10 furlongs. And uh, has demolished a quality field here, David. Travelled very well, hasn't he? We, um, we did say.